There are two basic types of wind turbines. Horizontal axis turbines. Vertical axis turbines. The size of wind turbines varies widely. The length of the blades is the biggest factor in determining the amount of electricity a wind turbine can generate. Small wind turbines that can power a single home may have an electricity generating capacity of 10 kilowatts, kW. The largest, utility-scale wind turbines in operation have electricity generating capacities of around 15,000 kilowatts, 15 megawatts, and larger turbines are in development. Large turbines are often grouped together to create wind power plants, or wind farms, that provide power to electricity grids. Horizontal axis turbines are similar to propeller airplane engines. Horizontal axis turbines have blades like airplane propellers, and they commonly have three blades. The largest horizontal axis turbines are as tall as 20-story buildings and have blades more than 100 feet long. Taller turbines with longer blades generate more electricity. Nearly all of the wind turbines currently in use are horizontal axis turbines. Vertical axis turbines look like egg beaters. Vertical axis turbines have blades that are attached to the top and the bottom of a vertical rotor. The most common type of vertical axis turbine the Darus wind turbine, named after the French engineer Georges Darus who patented the design in 1931 looks like a giant, two-blade egg beater. Some versions of the vertical axis turbine are 100 feet tall and 50 feet wide. Very few vertical axis wind turbines are in use today because they do not perform as well as horizontal axis turbines.